Hey, what is up everybody? Thank you so much for watching this video. Today in this video, I'm gonna tell you about the best iPhone and Android screen wearing app there is in the market. Now, I've been using this app for quite some time, but huge shout out to Apar Soft for reaching out to me and giving me a one year subscription for Apar Mirror. Now, I've, I've shown this app before in my previous videos, but it was not a review video, but this is a review video where I will I show you that you can mirror your iPhone to your laptop or your Android phone and vice versa. Now this is a free app for both the Android and iOS and it's also available for your laptop if you want to mirror your iPhone to your laptop screen, that's even that's possible too. And also you can control your iPhone screen or Android screen from your laptop, that's possible too. And also you can record your iPhone or Android screen. Now it's a free app but if you want to go more into depth you can buy a premium version, a little it's really cheap, not that, uh, not that expensive. Now, I've been using this app for quite some time now. Not because, not because they asked me to, but it's because I like to use it. Now, I have a diff I have multiple applications for this app because I like to show this app to my friends. Maybe he's asking, maybe she's asking for me for my phone, and I don't want to give her my phone, so I will screen share my iPhone to her Android phone. That's even possible too. Or maybe I just want to read notes from my iPhone to my laptop. That's possible too. Now it's pretty simple. Let's get into it. Now I'll be using my iPhone 7 Plus and my uh, next bit Robin to show you how it works. Now it's fairly simple. Just but there is one thing that you need to have a Wi-Fi connection on your uh, on your laptop and and on your other devices if you want to have this work. If you want to get uh, get this work. Now you can also use your, your phone hotspot if you have, like it's pretty simple, I've shown you tons of times that you can use your hotspot to make a Wi-Fi out of your uh, iPhone iPhone or Android. And that's fairly simple, just turn on your Wi-Fi on, on your iPhone and search for the APAR mirror in the uh, App Store. That's a free app, it's the best screen mirror app there is. Frankly speaking, I love this app. Not because I've been like not because they, they all asked me to. No, I just love this app because it's really great. You can you can you can do tons of stuff with this app. Okay, so when you download first, you download the app. It's pretty simple. It's uh, it's about uh, I think 15 to 19 MBs, which it won't take some it won't take long. Once you download the app, just open the app and also just make sure your uh, the A Power Mirror is a, is running on your laptop to make this work. So when you open the app on your iPhone, it will show you that there. It will show you a simple screen with a mirror option at the bottom. That will search like all the uh, current devices running nearby you. So if I want to search for uh, the nearby devices that are running a power soft, I'll go click on that mirror icon, that little circle, blue circle, and it will search for the uh, a power uh, a power devices in the area. So as you can see, that's my laptop right there. So when I click on that laptop, it'll, it will instruct me to do some stuff. That's pretty simple. When you click on that, just swipe up the control panel and click the screen mirroring. And that will show you that there is the Apple TV nearby, which is not Apple TV, that's my laptop. <coughs> so that right there, you can easily see that's that's my iPhone screen on my laptop. Now it's fairly simple. Now, but the <coughs> there are tons of applications you can use this for. For example, you are uh, like you are working on your project. You want to see a few notes, like every student does. Even me, I have tons of notes in my iPhone gallery, but I won't show you because I have tons of other pictures too, private pictures though. But you can show your, uh, you can use your, uh, use your laptop as a big screen, or even if you if you just want to play a game on your on big screen without having to spend anything, like PUBG, Fortnite. Because these games are really awesome. You can play on big screen without having to do anything. And also you can control it, by the way. If you have a mouse or a keyboard, you can use that as your, um, as your uh, controls in your laptop. That will work too. If, you are, uh, if, that, if, if your mouse and keyboard is connected to your laptop, but that's, uh, that's pretty much easy. <laughs> that's pretty, uh, what you call it, uh, ludicrous. Because laptop has a keyboard, you just need to install a new uh, mouse. That's it. So if you can rotate too, sometimes it gets stuck, but um, I think it's pretty cool. You need you can rotate if you want to for uh, you know different applications. You can also use full screen mode on your laptop if you if that's what you're uh, like. If you are in a lecture or something, you just want to show something to your uh, fa family, your friends, or even in a class or something. You can just go full screen, and also you can record it. Also, there is a very cool feature, and it's called whiteboard. 
you can sketch anything on your iPhone I mean on your laptop that will like if you want to highlight something you can just click on that whiteboard and it will highlight few specific features that you want to show other people that's 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 possible too so that's it for iPhone uh, Android that's it so I'm gonna use my uh, next bit Robin which is the uh, which is my daily driver for Android because I love the screen and the uh, design for this phone alright so uh, just open the Play Store uh, on your Android phone and search for the Apar mirror which is a free app on Android too so I'm gonna go search and download the app since I'm doing this for the first time on, on my Android phone so I don't use really I don't really use my Android phone that much so I'm gonna go and uh, download the Apar mirror uh, app on my Android. Once the app is downloaded, it's pretty much the same as exact same exact thing as the iPhone. So if you are uh, paying attention, it's literally the same screen. You just need to uh, click on that uh, mirror icon at the bottom, like a blue circle, and it will search all the nearby devices. Even if your iPhone is working in the background, that will show you there is an iPhone available. You can click on that iPhone, and will it will literally mirror your Android screen to your iPhone if that's your thing. I mean, who does that, by the way? But if you want to prank someone, like you are, you have installed uh, a yeah, Android or uh, operating system, like uh, like a Lollipop or uh, Oreo, the latest one. The app is downloaded. I'm gonna go open it now. Make sure your uh, your uh, Android Android phone is connected to your Wi-Fi, exact same Wi-Fi network as your laptop is connected to. So exact same thing. You just need to click on that mirror, that little little blue circle at the bottom, and we'll search for all the devices. Now that's the that's my laptop right there. If I go click on connect, it will show you it will show, give you some warnings. This uh, like uh, like it will capture your display on even on your laptop too. You just need to enable that. Once it's enabled, you need just just need to don't ask me again thing. Just click on that. It will work. It's not as easy as the iPhone because you have some uh, security reasons on your Android phone. So that's why you just need to enable that and uh, try it again. If that doesn't work the first time. And I'm pretty sure that will work for the second time because that's uh, you, you enabled the settings at the first time. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try it again, and that's it. Now it's working in the background if I if I'm if I'm not wrong. That's that my screen is showing in the background, but it's asking me for notifications. So I'm gonna go and disable or just skip this part because I don't want to show notifications on my. Uh, on my laptop, you can also you can do that. By the way, if you if you are if you want to see notif notifications of your i uh, of your Android or iPhone on your laptop, you can do that too. Like for example, if you're working or something, you don't have a phone, uh, or maybe your phone is charging or something, and you don't want to use your phone, you can sh uh, you can see your uh, messages, calls, text, on your laptop too. So, yeah. Anyways. Now, once he, I'm gonna sh now I'm gonna show you how you can connect your uh, Android phone to your uh, iPhone. Fairly simple. Just open the APAR mirror app on both the devices. Once you open both, once you open the APAR mirror on on iPhone and on your Android phone, just start searching for new devices. That will search for the iPhone, and iPhone will search for the Android devices. And you, uh, we can see the laptop too, but you don't want to connect your laptop because we've done that before. Uh, all right, so uh, start start the search by the uh, search icon, and you can just do that at the bottom of the screen too. So uh, you can see that my uh, Android has detected my iPhone 7 Plus, and my iPhone haven't yet because once you click on that, because it's kind of like a one-way thing. If you are searching for the first device, you need to close the app before doing that. So I'm gonna show you that my Android screen on my iPhone right there. That's the that's the iPhone screen. I mean that's the Android screen on my iPhone. Now that's literally the Android operating system on my iPhone 7 Plus. Now that's really cool. That's really really cool. If you want to prank someone, see you can, you can ask your friend to use your phone, your Android phone somewhere else, and you can just show this to your people like that. Anyways, uh, now we can do this uh, vice versa too if you want to. Like for example, I want to show my iPhone screen to my Android phone. That's possible too. Now, if the search is not working at the first time, you can use your you can use the key QR code. That's the kind of like a barcode that you that your iPhone will search for uh, for Android devices. So since my uh, iPhone was not detecting the, my Android phone, so I'm gonna go ahead and click the QR search, and that will search my iPhone. So now it's saying that you need to open yeah right there. Uh, 
uh, swipe up the control panel and click screen bearing and you click Robin that's that's the Android phone right there yeah right there once you click on your Android phone it will literally mirror your Android iPhone screen to your uh, I, I, I Android phone so that's pretty cool too you can control you don't you can't control the iPhone from your Android device by the way you can just watch you can just see the contents of your Android phone on uh, on your Android device so yeah that's it thank you so much for watching this video and also I'll, uh, I'll provide all the links in the description box below you can download the free app for yourself it's really really great app if you want to mirror your Android or uh, iPhone to your Android or even laptop so must check the APR mirror and thank you so much for watching guys peace out